so welcome back guys so it's, it crashed as you saw in the previous lesson so once you open this up go back in here click on set projects okay yes so just select that particular project is created click on set then come back in here i believe we should have everything back yes we do this is very that's why it's important kind of make sure you save you kind of set project for this so i just i'm not going to i'm not going to do much in here actually so just want to just want to fix some weird some weird stuff that's happening in here the directionality of this is just off this is what is this was freaking me out one two three direction is just weird and off okay i have another idea let's try let's try let's try i'll hide this for now let's make this visible maybe i can just create some hairs for that for that in front of this like this probably that should probably that should kind of force it probably that should force it to kind of follow the same directionality that we have around here Let's hope, let's hope that forces it. So I'm going to copy this one. Copy. Select this. Wait, did I? I don't think I copied it correctly. Copy. Paste. I'll do one more around the uh, one around the uh, it's quite much though but let's let's see if that forces it to it's not it's not forcing it uh let's see let me uh let's try 19 here yeah. not forcing it either and it's the groom i said the groom is the clumping rather since someone did somewhere let's see if i can remember copy effects let me drop this to one is this it Frame. I'm not going to share again. There's one particular setting, so I'm going to post somewhere around here. Generate again, save. I'm going to force this clump. Uh, This is one. Definitely not so in there. Man, this clump is freaking is freaking me out. It's freaking me out. How do I bend this over? Look at them. Look at these three devils around here. One, two, three devils. And they're not even respect. They're not even respecting. Let's see. Let's see. If I bend this over, even more like so. Okay, that seems to. What do I need to force this up? Oh, crap. Go. Let's select some more. Bend this even more. It's bending, but you're not accurately following it the way they should. You're not. It's not accurately following it the way it should. It's not. It's not accurate. It's not accurate at all.
Uh, let me see if we can find solutions online. So the suggestions online still says it's probably this copy guys, but let's let me put your thing in there. We don't even do anything. We don't even do anything. Uh, I might just even do oh, crap. I don't leave this way. This is this is freaking me out. It's freaking me out honestly. Let me just get this to fall. Can't you just can't I just get this to follow? Uh if you guys have some solutions you can suggest though, that would be that would be great. I think I'm done with this man. This is let's try variants. That's even does anything. I believe I have enough CV CV count for this because typically once you increase your CV count and then put this copy to one, suppose supposedly supposed to fix it. Supposed to fix it, but I don't know. Honestly, I do not know. Not know. One thing I can actually do to fix this is to just delete this extra hairs. But before I, before I do that, there's something I would like to do. Something I would like to do. Let's go into let's go into the clumping copy effects. Let's put one in there for everything. Maybe that won't, won't does anything. Already is annoying, annoying enough. Let's see if we can get some random values in here. Let's see if we can randomize this. Let's try this. No, let's try this instead. Mm, spacing out, <clears throat> spacing out the air too much though. Repeat this again. Let's use point eight. Nah. There's just one in there. Maybe just a regular randomizer. And I'll do something like I'll do something like from seven uh, no no okay from zero point seven rather zero point seven to one. Mm, this looks yes, I think. Let's try 0 0.5 to 1. Okay. Uh, I think I might just have to just give up on this. Probably just give up on this. Well, let's, let's, um, that's two things we need to do. Two more things we need to do in here we need to fade out the edge we need to fade out fade out the edge of this this marks I did this come back into the center edge hide this Come back in here. Solid brush. White. Okay. Put some black. <clears throat> Let's experiment with the back first. Let's see. We need. 
reflection to be on okay yeah this will work just need to increase the brush some more Okay. Save textures, save density marks. One thing I can certainly do though to kind of cheat the system is to this freaking annoying piece here. This freakishly annoying piece here. Yeah, a, little, a, little, a lot of annoying piece everywhere. So, oh, mark what's this? Select, mark all of this. Now, delete that, cut that out. See, so mark, this, mark these devils out. Mark these devils out, delete. Yes, at least that's that helps a, helps a bit just to clear that part that will trash out. Just ruin my just ruin the entire work. Probably I'll find a solution later on, but for now, this should be fine. Let me just do a quick save. Let's see. Let's see what happens when I no. Let's see what happens when I delete this guy. Doesn't even change much. Not not much change. Select this. Okay. Yeah, okay. Second thing we need to do is to create some stray hairs for this. So let's create some stray hairs for this. So back to modifier, I'll create a new noise. New noise. This frequency. Let me pop the frequency. Let's try try the magnitude. It's too much, too much, too much. Five. Yeah, it should be fine. So let's use straight as for this. Copy this. Uh, put this in here. I think I would like to randomize this. Let's randomize this. Let's do copy this. So I'm going to use it to do a value from one to five. Randomize from an intensity of one to five. One to five. Then description says three percentage. Let's try thirty percent. Nah, 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 that's just crazy. That's this is crazy. That's just crazy. So let's try ten instead. Yeah, this this looks this looks decent enough. This is decent enough. Okay. Very quick save. Uh -huh. All right. So yeah, I think this is. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Last. Coil, cut rather modifier. Modifier to this. Um, try value of zero point instead. Yeah, this is this is better. This is better. So 
the quick save um custom bucket uh, mm, this should work just fine this should work just fine let's bring back let's bring all of this back let's see what we have Yeah, this should be fine. Just leave this as it is. So this would be our first variation of set of pairs on top of this. So let's bring it forward. Looks like it's forward. It needs, it needs to be forward a bit more. <clears throat> it needs to be forward a bit more. Uh, let's experiment with that. Let's see if we can get this forward a bit more. Let's come in here. Let's paint white on top of this. Save this. Okay, finally, now we see the guy is kind of pushing more. Just is, I think the problem was that we needed to get more. We need to push what's it called? Push the maxim forward a bit more. So that that actually fixed it. That actually fixed it. Can imagine so that all we need to do just to push the max forward a bit more with the other settings we have already set up in there. Let's see, let's see. Good thing we good thing good thing we kind of added this more to kind of help us fix the weird issue we're having in there. Uh -huh. So I'm gonna kind of see how far out. We figure out how far out we need to have this in here. Mm. Okay. Go back in there. Get a bit more. Let's get a bit more. Save. Okay, yes, much better. Much better, definitely better. You just need to blow out the edge. Ah, oh, come on, come on. <laughs> Uh, back to this again. So set projects. Sets. Good thing we're saving us for this. Good thing we're saving. Since I was. 
So let's go back to this cup. I this. Told you, told you guys, right? Exigent can be sometimes can be really frustrating to work with. Solid brush, blur, black is fine. Tonal symmetry for this stroke reflection. <clears throat> Save. Save. Fantastic. Finally, 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 save. Let's see uh, modifiers. I feel like I can see through this. Cause it's this a bit more. The radius, especially the radius, let's radio, let's get this radius scale down some more. Let's see. This point probably way too much, and I need it to. Hmm. Uh, no, I need it to be a bit slightly higher. <clears throat> I think best view, let's do a quick save. I think the best view for this should be the side view. Side view give us a rough idea of how high this should be. Okay, guys, this should be fine. Now we have something that is close enough to the reference. So, oh, finally, finally, finally. So I'll come back. I'll come. We'll come back, and then we would. When we come back, we would um do the eyebrow and eyebrow and eyelashes. This was. So as a real pain. This backhead, backhead here. I think, I think I'd like to tune that, tune that a bit more. So we have for the clumping one, we have three. Let's try one. Let's see. This one does not really show that much, though. I don't use this AI reference. Let me look for something a bit more realistic. Something that should be a bit realistic for this. This is short hair. This is short hair, but the clumping value or the number for this. Let's see if we can get. Think, think I can work with. I can work with this. This I can maybe just point five or point seven instead. Let's try point seven instead. Yes, perfect. This is this is this is fine. This is fine. This is fine. Do a quick save. So, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next lesson. Bye for now.